All right, hey there, Prox News. This is Prox right here, and guys, welcome back to another episode of the Legend Zelda Majora's Mass. And hopefully, you guys, have yourself a good Sunday because this is the final part of the back-to-back -back episodes uh, for Majora's Mass here before we start heading on into Metroid Fusion once again. And uh, yeah, basically, uh, in the last episode, if you guys didn't miss out, we went and did some other type of side stuff. I think uh, we actually went and uh, I believe did the Iconic Graveyard. Uh, for the third and final night, which now we are completely done with the Iconic Graveyard. We don't really have to worry about anything else about that anymore. We literally already got ourselves the Captain's Hat. We already got ourselves all the different uh, tombstones to actually go and get uh, located. Uh, so that was actually pretty nice. So we're all good there. So that's about it. Um, now in this episode, guys, we're going to be going and uh, literally taking care of the spider houses. Now, uh, I believe I'm only just going to be doing just one spider house for today because I don't really think we're going to have enough time to literally do the ocean side house as well. But this one, I believe, is actually quite easy uh, compared to the ocean side house because I believe there's actually more uh, scotulas to actually be collected instead of here in the southern swamp. So that should be pretty interesting. Now I had now it has been quite a while since I have been in here. Uh, but I but I do know that you do need some bugs to go and search for the different uh, scotulas that are going to be in here. Now I don't know if you're going to be able to get yourself a heart piece or whatnot that that's going to be inside the spider house. Normally I think each spider house kind of contains a heart piece in it because if I do so remember correctly uh, in uh, the ocean side house you can actually get yourself a uh, a heart piece and uh, also you can get yourself uh, the 500 rupee uh, wallet as well too, which that is going to be a thing that I am going to be also trying to grab out as well here. So, uh, without further ado, guys, all we have to do is that if you actually do have your fire arrows with you, you can actually go and burn this guy down. Or, uh, another way is, is that, uh, if you are playing this game a little bit earlier and, uh, you don't really have the fire arrows right away, you can actually go ahead and actually use, uh, this little, uh, fire torch right here. And you can actually, uh, use one of your decky sticks to actually head inside this place. So, as long as you have, like, a few bottles with you and you are, and you already feel like you're, uh, stocked up with, with a few of these bugs, you should be... Uh, somewhat good because I think there's only like maybe one or four different spots that there's going to be some uh, uh, some things for now I think if you actually pick up uh, a rock here you can actually find some extra bugs down here if you want uh, but for right now what we're going to do is just head right on into this door and uh, hopefully we can find all the scotch list now if it does take me quite a while uh, here in this area where where if it like if I'm having trouble trying to figure out where every other scotch list is going to be um, what I will do is I will be cutting out uh, some sections uh, here in the scotch list house so let's go and do it so there is going to be a lot of scotulas so uh better be able to go and grab yourself uh the hook shot as well too because that is kind of another important type of item to also grab uh because you can actually uh, use your hook shot and you can literally grab these guys super easy so all you have to do is just kind of come on over here and suck that guy up and there you go get yourself your first gold scotula spirit now there's also gonna be some like climbing up on the roofs uh there's gonna be some like Kind of like hitting around some of the pots as well too so it's always good to like kind of know your surroundings and kind of figure out where you need to go so like for this one for example he's just kind of just chilling alongside this wall here so let's make sure to grab him because we don't want to forget about him so if i can just reach to my spot right there there we go guys so this other second gold ghostful spirit now we'll just check once more uh let me just here in my yeah, so I think there is going to be another one that is going to be right here. So I don't know how we're supposed to grab this one. I don't know if we have to use our bugs and they just climb up into that little section. But we'll go and do that right away. So do they just climb up the wall or something? Or do they just kind of just stay around underneath? Oh, here we go. Okay, so if you have your bugs right underneath here, uh, they should be able to just go and head right on in, and you should be able to go and pick up yourself another gold sculpture. Uh, so nice, there you go. Another gold sculpture has been captured. Now also too, make sure to go and check out on some of the pots, because you can also go and find another one that's just gonna be located right here, so. Nice, so four gold scotulas already just to start off with, so not too bad. Now, hopefully if I get out of here, hopefully they're not going to, like, respawn or anything like that. Because I, I would like to go and uh, pick up on some on some bugs right now. Because I'm kind of in the mood for some bugs right now. Maybe I should just grab some extra bugs just to be on the, on the safe side, you know? Because, like, because, like... 
I don't know how many of these holes are gonna be here, so I want to make sure that I grab enough. Oh wow, thank you for some hearts. Oh, but they're all gone now. Ah, oh, dang it. All right, well not to worry. We do have our arrows. We'll just put it back on. Okay, so time to continue. Now I still hear a school somewhere around here, and I don't know if he's probably on top of the second floor, maybe. Oh, okay, I think it stopped. No, he's somewhere. He's somewhere, but we can't really do anything about it right now. I don't think so. Yeah, we already kind of did all of our surroundings already. We already checked it alongside the water. We already went through all the other different spots. So let's just go ahead into here. So now this is where uh, things are going to get a little bit crazy. Because this is where we can go and check in some of these pots. And you can see if there's going to be a... Uh... Come on. Uh, what's with that Deku scrub? It's just sleeping here like a lazy fool. What a pain. Oh, man, really? All right. I'm sorry, Deku scrub, but I have to go hit you hit you right now. Oh, what? Hey. Wake up, you. Hmm. All right, maybe I have to become a Deku and probably try to wake him up from there. Hey, Deku. Hmm. How am I supposed to wake this guy up? Well, we did found our, our next uh, ghost ghost spirit, so I'm happy about that. But I believe there's still a pot that still has a uh, ghost in here. There we go. Well, okay. Well, at least I didn't get hit by that. That was pretty nice. Well, I know that I do see another one. I wonder if I can use my hook shot to. Hmm. It has to be like some sort of vine or something around here that I can just use. Right, now I did see a scorch that was around here. Ah, there you are. Come here, you. Oh, what? Eh. What? Hey. Crawl, crawl, crawl back down. Oh, what? Hey. There we go. Got him. Okay. That was a nice shot. Now if I can just reach that, then we're good. Alright, got our seventh one so far. Nice. So can we... Oh, it looks like we can uh, tear some of this stuff down and we don't even have to worry about the Deku Scrub at all. Ouch. Well, I guess we still do. Eh. You know, that got a little bit hurt there. So another... Skultula is here. So how am I supposed to wake up this dude? Do I have to like play like some sort of music or do I have to like place a bomb near him or something? What happens if I just place a bomb near him? Will he blow up? No. Hmm. What about if I use my special my special snot? Oh uh, no. What do you use my snot bubble? Cause that's how you normally knock out Deku Scrubs. What? This man's fast asleep. Okay then. Well, maybe not. Okay, up, left, up, right, A, right. There we go. You want me to come up a Deku Scrub and play it for you, man? There you go, now you're awakened. Hey, man. Eh. So off he goes right away. The heck? Where's he headed off to? Oh, he's just, uh... I guess he's just, uh, hiding back into the... Into the grounds below, then. Nice. Okay, so then we can just come up right up here, and I guess there's gonna be some more bugs if we still wanted to go and pick up some more, which I don't mind doing, because I want to make sure that we have enough bugs intact because we actually have a lot of boulders out here to or yeah well we do have a lot of boulders but we also have uh, a lot of uh, bottles as well too to uh, literally stock up with all these bugs so not too shabby now I do hear another one and I don't really see where you are like it has to be hmm 
Like, is there, like, a Lens of Truth area that I could probably use? And maybe if there's something around here? Hmm. Nope. Nothing by the slightest. So there must be some sort of squash that's just hidden behind here. Yeah, there is. Okay, so that's why. You were causing all this sound. Kind of confusing me. There you go. Alright, okay, so it's got our ninth one so far, so not too shabby at all. So we hit this, get some uh, get some ladders, so not bad at all. I don't think that actually disappears, so that's all good. Okay, so I do hear another one. It may probably be underneath here. Oh, there you are. Okay, I found you. Come here. Hey, I had you locked on. Nice, got our 10th one, and hey, wow, so back-to-back schools -back is here. Without a second one, that's in here. All right. Now, I do see that there is a door up here, and I don't know exactly on how we have to do it. Like, can we use uh, my bunny hood to probably jump across that? I think I can. I think if I actually do use my bunny hood, I think I can actually jump that. Because, uh, cause, like, we can run pretty fast. Okay. Here we go. Can I jump that? Oh, there we go. We made it. Nice. Uh, should I probably go and see what that pot's all about, though? I'm kind of intrigued to see what that pot's all about because there may be a hidden spider in here. Nope. Nope, they lied to me. So there's like two different doors here and I could have actually went ahead into that one. Okay, there must be something in here. They wouldn't put these blocks in here for nothing. Oh, wow, really? Okay, well, here we go. So here's another, uh, another hole. We can actually go and put one of these guys in now all right go bugs do your thing it's too bad that I can't grab these bugs once again yeah you just was going hide right back in there oh man we only just got okay oh okay we made it across all the better so here we are now we're in this part so they may probably tell me that there must be another skull threat behind this tree. Or maybe right here. <laughs> that could work. Now, I think inside the Ocean Spire House, there's like one area in particular where there's like uh, a lot of Skulltulas. Now, I don't know how I'm going to be able to knock down these guys because these guys are like... Oh, there's another one. Hey. There's a lot of Skulltulas here, man. Oh, there's also some extra bugs as well. Nice. Somebody tells me I think we get ourselves the truth mask in here, if I'm not mistaken. Because that seems like that seems like that's like the, the the mask that we're supposed to be grabbing in this area. Uh, but let me see. How am I supposed to grab you? Because you guys are absolutely insanely hard to grab. Now, hopefully, if I hit if I hit this, hopefully that's not going to bring out any type of B. It does bring out a B. Oh God. Watch out for the bee. Uh, no, 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 no. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Okay. Well, that was not a good idea. So I think if we just roll on in, or maybe we have to use up our uh, Goron mask, probably. We can make uh, a big loud hit, and that can probably knock down all these guys. Come on. There we go. So now we can go and uh, start hitting all these guys. Come on. Nice, nice. And grab our next one. So that is our 16th one. So, wow, there is just... So I think that is about all of the stuff that's here. And we got like four of these. Well, let's actually have... Just to be playing it safe right now. Just want to at least just carry up one more. Okay. So now we're good. I don't hear any more Skulltulas, so I think we're fine. So that's about it. So that's 16. 
So we're doing pretty good right now. Hmm. Well, there was a door down here. Why do I hear that there's like another school to the south somewhere? Maybe it's coming from this door. Huh. Well, now we're right back here. So please feel free to take a fresh spring water home with you. Huh. That seems a little bit intriguing. Maybe I have to use the water that's here at some point. Oh, well, there's another door right here. I don't think I ever checked out this way yet. Or maybe I have. No, this is whole. This is literally brand new. Okay. So now we're on the hunt for more of these guys, and I still see more. Oh, man. Alright, so there's no cutting here. It looks like I. I like, like, these guys are really not all that too difficult to, to, to get to get found because, like, they're pretty, uh. They're, they're pretty tameable. Now, I think probably in the ocean size, uh, in the ocean side house, I will probably start cutting things because there is, like, a lot of, uh. Of more, of more of those, uh, of those scotulas here in this place rather than in, in this area. Because I believe I think there's like 25 or so of these scotulas. At least it's not like, uh, at least you're like you're not uh, doing ocarina at time where you have to collect like a hundred different scotulas just so that you can get yourself like the max wallet. Like I don't think there would be any way in in heck that we ever be doing something like that. All right, so there we go. So we go and place down this guy. Make sure to go and grab all your bugs. Now, it seems like the last time that we actually put these bugs down, we actually got some arrows. So there is going to be some areas where there will be kind of like dud type areas. So there may be some areas that may probably actually have the skull so that we do need. So yeah, that's another dud. But I still hear another one. He's like somewhere. Is he, uh, chilling on this little column up here? Uh, yes I do. I do see it. Now we just have to, like, try and bang into it, it looks like. Come on. Maybe I have to climb all the way up and then probably hit him. Wow, that is some weird staring, or, or, or some weird type of laddering. Like, I have no idea what that is all about. Ah, oh, there you are. See, at least you made this simple for me. Hey, I said you were going to make this simple for me, and then you just start walking away. That's not very nice. There we go, got the 20th one. All good. Just a few more remaining. We'll just come around here. Oh, hey, I see you. You're just lurking in the distance over there. That's our 21st one. So I think we only got maybe one more room to go. All right, so I see that we got ourselves a Deku area. Ah, uh, yes. Okay, here we go. So these may probably be for the remaining of the other Skotulas that are going to be inside this area right now. There we go, 23rd. Then we'll just come across here and we'll start uh, see if there's anything else that we need to get done. I do hear one more and it's like somewhere around here. Oh, it may probably be uh... Oh. So is that where we have to go? So I do see that there's a second door up there and maybe that's where we have to really go from here. So we have to be like super careful with this one. Oh, okay, I have to put my flying skills back to the test again. Oh, great. You guys remember seeing me with the Deku mini game, though. I'll try and see if my, uh, if my skills are going to be that good or not. Now, I do hear another Skotula, so it has to be in this room. So, we'll have to fly all the way down this way. Alright, so I think I hear it somewhere here in this distance. So is there like another school village just somewhere like just chilling? Oh, there's like a few of them in here. Oh no, 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 no. Oh uh, no, 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 no. Ah! No, we got some bees! No! Oh! 
Okay. I don't even trust those bees in the slightest. Ugh. So there has to be a school store in one of these. There we go. Is your friend also in here as well too, or do I have to... Oh, come on here. There we go, that's our 24th one. I think there's only one more left, so it has to be in, in, in one of these. Yep, there's the other one. Alright, are we finished now? I think there's only 25. No, that's our 25th one, so there's still more to get collected. Jeez, where's the others? Whoa, okay, that was just way too much of a close-up right there. Hmm, so we got some magic. But apparently I still hear another Skosula. Oh, there you are, hey! You're just chilling right there all this time. 26-1, alright, not too shabby. So I guess if we ever hear, like, any other type of, like, Skosula sounds, I guess that that means like there's gotta be some other specialists just uh, hanging around so I don't hear any more so I think we're literally done okay, I haven't heard any other type of sound around here at all lately hmm so I know that there's no other sounds that were here, because I don't hear anything. I'll go and check back over at the tree area, see if there's uh, anything else that I missed, but I believe we already grabbed everything that was over at the tree. So I don't hear anything else. We already... Yeah, so we went through here. Like, we went through, like, almost every single room, and I don't really hear any other sound after this. We come on down in this way. Uh, anything else hidden? I know I see another one of those, but I don't trust it because it's a bee. It may probably be a bee. Huh. I hear another sound. I vaguely hear it. It has to be, yeah, there it is. There's the other guy. Hey, I see you. Where'd you go? Where'd you go, man? I literally saw you. Oh, there you are. There we go. That's our 27th one. can't be in here because I've already checked this area. Oh, okay. Right, right. Ah, and there we go, guys. I finally found the last Spoosla. Uh, there we go. So now the curse has been lifted inside the Southern Swamp. So there's just only three other uh, Skootsalas that I was just uh, kind of missing out. And I'll actually show off uh, those other two sections that I just found uh, the other Skootsalas as well, too. Uh, I'm so happy that I finally found all those. They were uh, in a really well, like, secluded type area. I didn't really get to see, like, on top of the, uh, of that one section, uh, that was just there, like, five seconds ago, but I'm happy that we finally, uh, figured out where that one is, and now we can go and actually talk to this guy, and he actually has a mask for us, which, uh, that is gonna be, I believe, the, um, uh, 
I can't really remember what it's called, but I know it's not called the Lens of Truth, but it's called like the Mask of Truth or something. I'm pretty certain that's what it's called. So I've been saved. I thought that I was going to die. Uh, you see, a while back, someone told me that I could become a rich, uh, and uh, he gave me this mask. He said that the instructions were inscribed somewhere, and uh, but when I went to look, I was cursed. If I had known it, it would have been such an ordeal. I would never would have taken it. So here, take it. It's yours. Nice. So now we got ourselves the Master Truth. This is the same mess that the that the Sheikah spoke of, which of course you guys may probably know about the Sheikah because uh, they are kind of infamous in uh, Breath of the Wild as well. So uh, as soon as I get it together, I'm going home. All right. So I'm going to be heading home as well too because, geez, man, that was insane. I don't want to be inside that spider house anymore. But I'm going to end off this episode here for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We kind of did a little bit of stuff uh, here so far for one of the side missions. We just literally did the Southern Swamp Spider House. And now, guys, we're going to be heading on over to another spider house, which that is going to be the Oceanside one. So that was actually going to be a little bit more difficult than what uh, this one was actually going to be about. Because I believe there is 35 Spotsless inside the Oceanside. So, so there's a little bit extra more spiders that we do have to go and literally uh, figure out where, where all of them are going to be. So uh, don't forget to leave a comment, like, or subscribe. I'll see you guys then. You guys should also be seeing a Pokemon Nightmare Moon also happening for you guys for Sunday as well too. So I'll see you guys then and, uh, and peace.